They talk about redshift and Cepheid variables. We can cover plenty on that it, based on the theory that the Doppler effect also affects light. We don't know that it does. Oh my god, have you never heard of Doppler radar? It uses the Doppler effect of light to determine the wind speeds inside of a storm. You see, it works something like this. The radar emits radio waves, which reflect off of a raindrop back to the radar. The distance to the raindrop can be determined from the time it takes the radio waves to reach the raindrop and return to the radar. If the raindrop is moving towards the radar, the reflected radio waves have shorter wavelengths than the radio waves emitted by the radar. The speed of the raindrop can be determined by comparing the wavelengths of the reflected and transmitted radio waves. Similarly, if the raindrop is moving away from the radar, the reflected radio waves have longer wavelengths than the radio waves emitted by the radar. And you can also determine the speed of the raindrop by comparing the wavelengths of the reflected and transmitted radio waves. This is just the Doppler effect of light.